Good morning. Um, one essential for doing outdoor masonry work on the uh, side of uh, buildings, houses, etc. etc. This is a, a, a cottage that uh, I've been roped into uh, painting. And I've already painted this uh, some time ago, well, it was a couple of days ago. But this is an extended pole, and uh, I've got a big fat roller on the end of it. Um, it's, a, it's a trade mate Harris extension pole, and this roller and pole extension pole completely cut out uh, the need for um, using a, up and down a ladder, up and down a ladder, up and down a ladder with a, a, a roller. So uh, just to show you the extent of this, it's, um, it's a five meter job. Just twist this here and this extends out. Now it, it is in a confined space like this, it's difficult to get it into your tray but it can be done and I did the bulk of this wall using this uh, extension. So there's it secured and this is the kind of distance up the, uh, the uh, gable wall that you can do even right up into the apex. Now it, gets, it does get a wee bit bendy if you lift it off so this is absolutely essential for this kind of work. Saves so much kind of effort. So now, the, uh, there is a problem of course. You cannot really get into uh, underneath the eaves. So you will have to use a ladder at some stage. Uh, and Cutting in, obviously, in round the window and, and uh, right in underneath the window sill there, you know, you, you, you can't get up it without splashing paint everywhere. But even over here, you, your, your extension pole will do the job. Absolutely a, a brilliant piece of kit. Um, can't remember how much we paid for this, um, and I don't even know where it was paid for, uh, bought. But uh, I'll look it up um, and put it in the video notes uh, in underneath the, the video. So <laughs> you're probably looking at my uh, uh, coat here and said he's, he's more paint on the blooming coat than he has on the wall. And you'd be absolutely correct. I'm not a professional painter. I'm a total amateur. <laughs>